And we are back with some more custom zombies here on Black Ops 3. Welcome to the channel. My name is Lagan, and if you want to support today's video, go ahead and hit that like button with Lucille. The barbed wire baseball bat that killed Stowe. Oh, I would never spoil it for you guys. I would never. Little Walking Dead reference there. Oh my god, what an episode last night. Am I right, UK people who haven't seen it yet? I'm not going to spoil it. Don't you dare worry about that. Don't you dare worry about it. But if you're new around here, we do a lot of zombie stuff. Custom zombies. Very, very, very close to doing some infinite warfare zombies. So stick around to the end of the video. If you do like my content, consider subscribing. We just now hit 260. Thousand subscribers, so uh, slow growth, but growth none, the less, never, the less. I don't know the saying actually, now that I'm saying it out loud, but either way, here we are. We're doing VFW Zambers, check it out. VFW is for veterans, it's like a private club found in cities all over America. I think you have to be a veteran, and then you get a pass and you could go in. Looks like all we need though is to bribe somebody $750 and we can go in whenever we want. Back off, zombie! Kind of coming in with a little jog to him here on round number two, but it's kind of a big map, so I'm glad he programmed it that way. Otherwise, it would be very slow. I'll leave a link down below to this if you want to download it and give it a try yourself. Absolutely do it. Let me know how you end up doing. Hey, zombie. Okay, you guys are really, really kind of annoying for this size of room. I guess get a better gun, I guess. Um, also today, guys, very, very important, very cool stuff on the channel. Went live a couple hours ago. You might have been at school. Uh, you might have been at work. Depends on when you're watching this, actually. Uh, but some exclusive MW Remastered is on the channel. I just got back from a trip out to Raven, the developers for Call of Duty Modern Warfare Remastered. And we got to play some of the maps you haven't seen yet. Uh, that were available to play at COD XP, right? These are different from those maps. So we got some new maps. I'll be showcasing them all week long. Got four maps and some really cool surprises in there. So stay tuned for that. There will be a link in the description if you want to go check out some multiplayer gameplay footage of Modern Warfare Remastered. Um, and like I said, we'll have some out throughout the week. I'm going to get this gun because I don't trust this. I'm going to earn some points out here where there's a nice big section. And then we'll explore the map, maybe at the end of round four, maybe at the end of round five. Use all this RK5 ammo, then we'll do some exploring. I'll make a crawler, because uh, these zombies are coming in kind of hot, you know? Kind of hot. But the trip out to Raven was awesome, man. It was such a cool experience. It was a couple of weeks ago, so I've been sitting on this footage for like two weeks now. It's been driving me crazy. I've been wanting to share it with you guys for so long. And now I finally get to, uh, let's see, who's out there with me? I'm sure you guys want to know the good stuff. Uh, Mr. Dollar JD was out there with me. Uh, Chucky. Chucky Gaming was out there, and I Crazy Teddy, Hollow Point, by the way, oh, <laughs> OG X Rays, uh, some French YouTubers that you may or may not know, but one of them's name is Skyroz, he's a cool dude, I like him, and then a couple other guys I didn't know from France, and then there was a day two event uh, where some other YouTubers came in, uh, like Noah and Chaos T Martin, and uh, I saw those guys. Uh, in the hotel that morning as I was going to leave and they were going to head out to Raven for their recording day. So very cool to see all my friends and uh, and just get to experience a brand new studio. So, you know, I've been very fortunate. I got to go out to Treyarch three times this year, Cod XP, and now Raven. Hopefully I'll get to go to Infinity Ward at some point. And fingers crossed, we'll record some early zombie gameplay as the DLC comes out for IW Zombies. Or maybe even if there's a launch event for IW Zombies. I'm not sure. I don't know anything about that. So, fingers crossed, maybe we'll have some early access zombie gameplay as well. But just, uh, just a great time. Just a great time. Awesome atmosphere out there at Raven. Uh, I, I thought maybe this was a barrier. It's not. Okay, so... What we're going to do now is finish this round up, make a crawler, and we'll go explore. We'll go explore. Let me make sure this isn't a bear. I'm sure it's not, though. I'm sure. Yeah, it's not. And is there anything back here? A little back door to the VFW being sneaky? Sneaky cheeky? Nope. Just a whole lot of room to play in. Back off, zombies. Back the hell off. Whoa, hey. I forgot what button to slide. Oh, yeah, C. C to slide. Nope, that's... Oh, God. What have I done? Is it not C? Yeah, it's C. Sorry, mouse and keyboard. Still learning. Still learning. Normally I would play with the controller plugged in, but uh, my controller's not very compatible with Black Ops 3. It kind of it kind of just deactivates itself halfway through the game, which causes me to get killed a lot. So this way we won't have any issues. Well, 
except for the not knowing how to slide issue, of course. Go get a max ammo. Now, before I thin out this herd too much, let's definitely prep a nade. Okay, that's not how you do it at all. Let's definitely <laughs> prep a nade. And uh, suck on that, zombies. How do we get? How do we get? Oh my god. Come on, man. I gotta kill this dude. I can't explore a map with a runner. All right, we'll try next round. We'll try, we're, at least we're gonna have a lot of points to explore the map. Probably open up a good amount of it and see what's going on. I would explore right now, but I, I just know better. I just... Oh, wow. You, I'm in the water. We're, are we swimming? Yes! <laughs> sort of. We're just gliding around. Oh, there he did a swimming animation. Awesome. Okay, we're going swimming later for sure. For sure! Zombie, please. Ooh, tough guy, eh? Um, maybe I should try to make a crawler a little sooner. Why don't we pile them all up? You understand? And then just throw a grenade. And then when there's 20 zombies, chances are one of them is going to crawl for us. So we'll try that. We'll try that. That's the new strat. Then we're going to go, I guess, work our way over to the box or maybe even go inside the VFW to start out with. I don't know. I don't want to know. I don't know what I want to do first. All right, zombies. Cooperate. Oh, <laughs> okay. We got a crawler. At least we have a crawler now. Amazing stuff, Lagan. You did it. Your strategy is top notch. It cannot be compared to. So, of course, like I said, I am not going to spoil The Walking Dead. I won't talk about this week's episode until like next week. We give everyone a week to watch it. I will say this, and this is not a spoiler of any kind, okay? So don't be afraid. Don't mute the video. You're fine. That was by far the most graphically sadistic dark episode I've ever seen out of any television show that I've ever watched on TV. And that's, 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 I mean, that's putting it, that's putting it mildly. It was, it was so messed up, but that's it. That's all I'm going to say. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry if any of you thought that's a spoiler. It's not, all right? It's not. You all know. You all knew if you watched season six what was about to happen, but you just don't know to who. Hmm. <laughs> oh, Lagoon does. All right, zombies. Let's thin out the herd a little bit. Little bit. Come to me, little fella. Got you. Uh. Now, there we go. All right. These three will be just fine the way they are. We're going inside the VFW. I got 8,800 points. So let's see what's in here. A smart guy would go to the box first. We got to find power, though. Maybe it's in here. Oh, look. See, it's like a little lodge. And war vets come in here and they, I guess they smoke their cigarettes. Look at that. Black Ops 3 freaking mod tools. How about it, man? We're talking about cigarette smoke, busted plasma TVs. What is this? Nothing. Oh, oh, that's something. What are you? Oh, this is power. Okay. It's a lantern telling us the power's in here somewhere. <gasps> we have to build power. Awesome. Let's find power parts. Okay, that's cool. We got buildables. What the hell? What is this? It's very dark right there. The shadowing's weird, but we're in here now. Uh, any power parts in here? Nope, but look, we found uh, Juggernog. Once the power's on, that'll probably become a little more clear. Go in here. And we've got Speed Cola. No power parts in here either, huh? All right, well, maybe we gotta look around outside a little bit. Or maybe even in here a little more thoroughly. See, I haven't really looked around on the ow, pool table yet. Nothing. Uh, what is that? Nothing. So power is usually like a big metal box, uh, a handle, and sometimes even a hand. That's it. I want to go behind here. Oh, Deadshot Daiquiri's back there. Yeah, let's go behind the bar before we leave here. So this, we got a couple perks in here for sure. Some good ones too. Oh, wait, another door. We got to save some points. Oh, schnazzy. We got ourselves stamina up. Meal kick, packs the punch, a bunch of empty kegs right here. Oh boy. These war veterans are partying back here. Look at all this beer. All right, all right, hold on. Hold on, zombies, calm, calm down. Let me out, please. Done nothing to you. Just wanna look behind the bar, see what we've got. Oh, we can mantle it, thank God. We're not gonna get trapped back here. All right, over we go, ah, yes. All right, maybe we'll check out in the back. Nothing really in there. There's a lot of perks in there, but nothing in the way of the, the table's okay. Hey, here we go. This is one of the parts for sure. All right, one part down. See if we can find some more. We need it's usually three, but every now and then 
there will be uh, the, the switch in the hand will be one part, but some maps they're two parts, like a hand and a switch. Let's check out here thoroughly, because you never know. You never know what could be down this sneaky river or back here. Like, see, this would have been a good spot. A lot of people wouldn't have come back here and checked. We definitely need to get a gun, though. I've got 3,500 points. Let's not spend all my money until I, uh, until I at least get a gun. Because right now, we're out of ammo. I could go buy RK5 ammo, I guess. I guess. Well, it doesn't look like there's going to be anything in the river. I was hoping that I just was outsmarting the mapper, but I guess not. I guess he has played us. Congratulations. I played myself. What is this now? Oh. Oh, whoa, hey, whoa, the switch right there. Hey, stop, zombie, I found it. All right, two parts down. So we are looking for the hand, unless it's just a two-part build, let's find out. We should find out before I start looking around for something that doesn't even exist. Uh, through here. All right, let's see. Thank God, didn't have the hand attached to it. All right, hey, the lights came on in here, good. It's nice and bright now. So we could get we can actually buy jug and maybe even a wall gun in here real quick and just start the next round Let's see how much are you if I do the math. I don't have enough. Let's do it anyways. Ha! I did it anyways right, Let me get out of here. This is a bad idea to play in here All right, let's go back outside where it's nice and safe big area. We got a decent gun We'll definitely spend the box um, if this mapper included the update that black ops uh, mod tools Beta mind you this is still in beta. So they're getting updates, which means new stuff. Oh look all the lights are on and now That's pretty cool. So they're getting new stuff added um, So this latest uh, update that they got for the beta included a bunch of DLC weapons now Unfortunately the weapons were included the sound for the weapons were not so a lot of the guns ooh, A lot of these DLC guns are muted, but it's still cool to have them So if we get that mark three if the mapper updated this map, maybe this map actually came out after so he didn't have to update it? We'll see, we'll see. We'll spin that box and see what's in there. Ooh, we can use that and pick up... Use this gun. Here we go. Pick this up. Use the MR6. Do some knifing. Okay, not those two. Where's the single zombie at? I just want to knife somebody. Here comes one. Hey, I'm going to knife you. I'm going to knife you. Gotcha, buddy. Oh, let's not get stuck. Oh, have you ever wondered? Like, so every single zombie apocalypse movie... TV show, couple of things. Two things I want to point out. Have you ever noticed that they have never heard of zombies in their life? It's like in their world, their universe, they don't have zombie movies or something? Oh god, Insta Kill ran off. Right? Is that it's like that drives me crazy. So like there's clearly a human that's come back to life. They're eating a body on the ground or something, and then the people in that movie or television show are like, what is that? Why is he eating that person? No one ever says, oh, that's a zombie, like in the movies. <laughs> it never happens. It drives me insane. Insane. And then the other thing I've noticed about about zombie shows and movies are these damn fires everywhere. Like, okay, who's, why are these cars on fire? But it's like that in the shows and the movies, too. Like, how do the fires happen? Every car is on fire in, <laughs> in this map right now. And there's it, it just makes no sense to me. Like, who went around catching shit on fire? Anyways, things I noticed about zombie stuff. Okay, cool. Well, we can get Jug now and kind of move on a little bit. Okay, how about we go through the door like a normal person, Lagoon? Uh, Jug was in the bathroom here. Thanks, Jug. Gotcha. All right, there should be a Bible ending on this map as well. Don't know where it's at, but we are going to find it, and then we're going to buy our way out of here. Ah, uh, I thought that was maybe a clue. A raging clue. Oh, God, I'm stuck. Oh god. Okay, let's go this way. We'll go out the long way. A clock. A clock tells the time. You know what a clock is. It'll make me explain everything. Alright, so over here is where they have their picnics, possibly. There's not much left to this map, huh? What is this? Oh, it's like a little bar? I'm gonna hit that box up a little bit. Oh, Widow's Wine's over there. Very cool. Uh, I definitely saw a little Arnie's. I saw the Stein in there. I definitely think some of the updated stuff is in here. Where is the damn viable ending? Where is it? That's the whole map, but now I don't know where it's at. Can we mantle up? We sure the hell can. Got a good gun now. Um, hmm. Well, let's think about it. Clearly, I've missed the viable ending somewhere. But we'll find it at some point. Worry not. 
Aha! So I was walking around trying to find this Bible inning, and I did find one more door that I didn't open. And it's right over here, and it doesn't lead outside. It leads to a small room with the what? <laughs> Damn it! I was trolled! Oh my god! Alright, I'm still looking for this Bible ending. I'll be back when I find it. If there is one. I hope I didn't make that up. Alright, good news! I did find the Bible ending. <laughs> it's in a section that we were already at. Uh, I just walked right past it without even noticing it, but here, we'll, uh, I'll show it to you right now. As soon as I can maybe not get my head stuck on the ceiling. Here, it's over here. In the Pack-a-Punch room, right? So yeah, these three things. But then over here, the kegs? Press F to do a keg stand and black out. 25,000 points. No problem. So let's work on getting, uh, let's work on getting the perks. I went ahead and bought Double Tap. Uh, we're going to work on getting some perks, and we're going to work on getting some, up. Uh, I'm going to see if we can get some cooler guns out of the box. And then we'll pack a punch something, see what the camo's like on this map. And we'll buy out of here. 25,000 points. Very reasonable. Very easy. Shouldn't be a problem at all. Hopefully you guys are enjoying this custom zombie Black Ops 3 VFW map. Again, if you do want to play it, I'll have it down below in the description of the video. Just click on that link. Make sure you have Steam installed. Make sure you have Black Ops 3 on PC. You pretty much got yourself a map in any map for free. Because that's how it works with custom zombies. It's completely free unless you run across a greedy ass mapper who uh, begs for donations and <laughs> and uh, wants you to pay for his shit. And that's never gonna happen. In fact, that's against the freaking rules, but I better hope nobody lets Activision know about that, if that's what you're all about. That ain't cool. Let's go this way. Oh, by the way, I'm not talking about anybody in particular. I'm just, I'm just saying, I'm just saying. Don't think about charging for maps. It's not a smart idea. You get in trouble. Let's go. Got this BRM. Very nice. Oh, you know what? We can go spin. We got this insta-kill. Zombies shouldn't be bothering us that much. Plus, we have double tap. So we're extra strong right now. I do need to get speed call as soon, though, because I hate playing without it. It's like one of my favorite things in the world. Here, let's take a good look. Good, good hard look. Yeah, yeah, I saw the PPSH in there. Yeah, I saw the shadow claws were in there. Okay, cool. Definitely got some of the new guns in there. Can we just get one of the new guns? There's a lot. The uh, Rift 9, I just saw that Rift E7, whatever the hell it's called. Peace, Peacekeeper, that's a new one. Peacekeeper Mark II. Oh my god, I'm stuck in the... Uh, get out of the water! Oh god, they're gonna kill me. Please stop, zombies. Please! Yes, yeah, swim for swim for it, lagging. Get out of here. Alright, we're back to safety. That was a bad idea, actually, going over there. Start of a round, messing around with that box. Oh! And as you can see, there is no gun sound. That was what I was explaining to you earlier. Uh, th that'll come. A little bit at a time there. From, uh... Ooh, I want that. I definitely want that. Alright. Yeah, they're just kind of giving out a little bit at a time here right now with these mod tools. I'm hoping stuff like the skull of Nam Swape, and the bows, and spider bait, and hell, even the big giant boss spider might be something that they throw in the mix sooner than later. I think that'd be really awesome. Alright. We're gonna do it again. Let's just go spin the box again. Let's just push our luck. Doesn't matter. Zombies can't stop us. Can't stop. Won't stop. Here we go. Give me the PPSH 41, the Raygun Mark III, or Little Arnie's. Or I guess the Wonderwaff. It'll be fun to play it for a minute. Let's go. The Wonderwaffa DG2. Oh, yeah, that's another thing. The uh, gravity spikes or the um, the DG4 Ragnarok DG4 would be something they could put in for us, which would be great. Uh, oh, oh. The Guard of Fafnir, or the Shield of of Domination. I don't remember what it's called. Nobody does. Uh, but yeah, there's some really cool stuff from Garad Karovi yet to be added in. So lots to still come, including more models, you know, like uh, like these cars. I don't know if the mapper did this, but they're not, like, textured properly. So, you know, more models and couches and chandeliers and things. More ground textures, you know, stuff like that. It's just going to get better and better with custom zombies on Black Ops 3. It's going to be amazing. Amazing. This time next year, like, you're going to have... If a mapper takes his time and is skilled with the program, you'll have maps that are like Treyarch maps. So far, we don't have any maps that are like Treyarch maps. There's been some fun ones, though. There sure has been. I think, uh... Uh, Fabric Duton was, uh, Fabric Durantoton, I think it was called, it was pretty damn good. Um, and then I'm waiting for my boy Chaos's map to come out. You Always Win has done a couple of fun maps as well, especially their, their Mario, Custom Zombie Mario Halloween map. That's on the channel too, if you want to check that out. That was really good. I like that one, so. Yeah, we got some good things to come, people. 
All right, here. I'm going to spin a couple more times here, and then I'm going to start uh, getting my perks and I'm not going to mess with the box that much anymore. But I really want... Ah, yes, please. We'll do one more spin. Maybe we'll do two more spins. Two more spins. Because I want to see if we can get the PPSH or... Uh, stop it. Or, and I don't see them in there, but maybe the Mark Threes? Are they in there? Yeah, I don't see them at all, actually. All right, one more spin. One more spin. Come on. <laughs> I'm, so, I'm so bad at this. I'll just keep spinning all day. You. One more spin. Stop it, lagging. Stop with the spinning. All right, seriously, this has to be it here. We need to start working on stuff. Oh, it's so boring. Do it again. One more. <laughs> just anything. Anything that's new. Come on. Oh, the Mark Threes are in there. All right, that's not a points builder. I would keep this. But I'm going to keep the, uh, the Riff uh, E9 over... The ray gun, I think. Oh, come on! Damn it! I need a points build gun to go along with my Rift E9. This will be my power gun. It's very strong. And then we'll just need a points building gun. And this is not a points building gun. This is a one shot, one kill, one hit or quitter. And we don't need that. Okay, I went ahead and got some more points. The very next box spin that has a new weapon, a DLC weapon, that is capable of points building, I'm taking and I'm done with the box. So come on. Give it to me. Something good, please. Okay, that's capable of points building, and this is not really a DLC gun, but this is not a gun you would normally find in Black Ops 3 Zombies unless you're playing Shadows of Evil, so I like that we got it. Let's grab some perks. Probably shouldn't have bought this. Probably should have gotten... Oh, gee, I don't know. Speak Cola, but... Uh, I was going to buy Widow's Wine at some point anyways, but now I don't know if there's, like, a perk limit on the map. Uh, I guess we'll find out. I guess we'll find out. So, we need to get enough for Speed Cola, and I think Stamina Up would be good to have on this map, and then enough to Pack Punch. So we're looking at about 10,000 points needed, and then we can start doing our viable ending. But look, this has got gun sound, and this was recently added in the latest, um, in the latest update for Black Ops Mod Tools. So I don't, I'm not sure why most of them don't have, or all of them bought this one, but I'll take it. Well, I guess it's technically not a DLC gun either. This was in-game. Double points, hell yeah. Bring it on, zombies. I love this because if you've been watching me play custom zombies for a long time, World at War custom zombies, of course, have the Type 100, which is my favorite SMG aside from the PPSH-41. If you had to pick an SMG that wasn't the, the PPSH-41, a lot of people would go with the Thompson, a lot of people would go with the MP40. For me, it was this thing. Right, and it, it turned into the uh, thousand and one. Uh, what is it, samurai? Shit, I forget what it's actually called. Man, that sounds about right. So that's what we'll go with. Okay, <laughs> thousand and one samurai. I feel like that's right, actually. Uh, so this is the Sten. I call it the Stein a lot for whatever reason. That pisses people off. But Sten, I think is how it's actually pronounced. Whatever. Don't care. Call it what I want. Let's get inside really quick. Uh, speak cola. We do not want to get trapped in this bathroom. Go 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 go. Got it. And if we get stamina up while we're in here, that'll be all the perks I'm interested in buying. You understand? But well, we gotta get out of here. They're just gonna start spawning in. And I do not wanna be stuck in this building because we'll never get out. Okay, Woo. we're out, no problems. And look, we're only 1,500 points away from pack a punching the bootlegger. and turning it into an absolute beast. And we're gonna rip through these zombies until we get 25,000 points. We'll leave this thing unpack a punched because honestly, it doesn't have any sound, so I don't like using it. Um, because that's kind of boring for you guys not to hear the pew pew noises that guns make. But for now, I'll use it because I'm out of ammo in the bootlegger. Almost out. Almost out. Uh, you guys interested in some Battlefield 1? Uh, multiplayer is a little hard to capture. I mean, I have to do some strong editing on that because I like playing Conquest and Rush. And each of those matches are typically about 30 minutes long. I know it's not any different than my zombie videos, but you're not here for multiplayer, so I don't want to post 30-minute multiplayer videos. I could do some campaign stories, which are awesome, by the way. I don't know. You guys let me know down in the comment section. If you're interested in some Battlefield 1 stuff, do let me know, and I'll hook it up. I'll hook it up. Been having fun. I've been having fun with that, and I've been having fun with the IW beta as well. Oh, yeah, a little wine grenade. I forgot. Here. Here. Hold on to that for me, zombie. Hey, crawlers. Love it. Okay, good shooting. You were that close and you missed the shots. Good job, man. All right, here. We're going to go ahead and pack a punch this guy. And let's see if we get any cool camo. 
Please have awesome camo. Der Ice and Drac, I think, is what everyone's using right now. It must have just been added. Nope. Nope. No camo at all, huh? Okay. Well, it's fine. It's stronger. It's stronger and we have ammo in it now. Oh, baby. Let's go. We need 25,000 points. Play the damn music. going to be about it for the points we need. There it is. 25,000 points. We can do the Bible inning now. Get the hell off this map. This hellhole. This VFW custom zombie map. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, of course, make sure you leave a like on it. Help support the channel as we move forward into 2017. God, it's right around the corner. And here we go. Let's drink the kegs. Let's do a keg stand and black the hell out. Oh, yes, baby. We did it. Thanks for joining me for the video, guys. Don't forget to check out Modern Warfare Remastered exclusive content on the channel all week long. If you have any suggestions about my content, please leave them down in the comment section. I love you, and I mean it.